Hello and welcome. I'm going to do a plan with me right now. And if you're coming from the unboxing of this release, I'm going to, this is everything right here. I'm going to put it away and pull out everything that we're going to be using for this plan with me. The first part of the plan with me will be me just talking and putting things out here and showing you a couple things. Then I will switch to voiceover mode and speed it up so you don't have to sit through a ton and ton and ton of stuff. So let's put all this, this is all going to get put away. So I am going to be planning the week of the 24th for August using the Tea with Jam. And this is what the Tea with Jam looks like. So this is a mini kit in case you're coming here not from the unboxing. This is one of the new kits, mini kit. And it comes with these four pages right here. And then this and this are add-ons. So this is what I'm going to be using. I've also got my planner. So we're going to be using my Erin Condren. And this is the week of the 24th. And I've got all my little tools here. There's a couple of extra washies that I pulled from Simply Gilded. I've got a gold perforated and then this kind of like peachy pink with the little gold bows. I think that's going to be super cute. Go pretty good with this kit. My pan, I'm going to show you really quick. I got this the other day and it fits inside my work bag. So I see a lot of people doing that. What's in my bag? So this actually fits right inside my work bag so that when I'm at work and I wanna just grab my planner stuff, all I have to do is pull this out of my bag and take it with me and I've got all kinds of like funny little things on here. I've got a little, little furry, fun little furry things that's actually on my planner. So my planner is here and I'm using a TN size. This is the one that goes with me to work. The Erin Condren is what stays here at home. And then in here I've got my little bullet journal got my little writing board and my stickers, my little stickers. These are the ones that just go with me and then I have all my little pens and my goodies that stay in little pockets on the sides. And I picked this little guy up at Tuesday morning and it actually is made to go inside of a bag. So I use this inside of my big, I have like a big beach bag that I take to work and that has like all my other stuff in it and this. So just showing you that real quick because it's going to be off to the side of me grabbing stuff from it. So for this one here, I'm going to be doing, since I'm kind of doing this kind of in advance, so this is kind of forward planning. Um, there won't be like a ton of um, actual stuff written down here. That'll all happen later on. But i show you here is the week that I'm actually on right now. So this one will start here. And then um, this was last month's Simply Gilded kit. So that's on this page. And then this one you saw me do the plan with me that I'm filling out. And I've been such a bad... I have to go and backwards plan right here because I was so busy making kits <laughs> that I didn't finish filling out my planner. So I will do that, but this is it kind of all filled out um, and you can see how I use it. So that is that. And now I will go ahead, stop talking and speed up the video and start the voiceover. Alrighty, so I'm going to speed this up. It's about eight times faster than what it actually took me to do. We're going to put down our bottom washi, and it's got some really cute pumpkins, and just the colors are just absolutely gorgeous. I love the greens and the oranges, and there's some mushrooms in there, and I think it's just a really, really pretty transitional kit, and these colors just pop off the page. They're just really not your traditional autumn colors, so that's why I think it makes a really pretty um, transition kit. I used watercolors for the background, which I made all of those backgrounds myself and I'm going to start adding my date dots on top of my days of the week. Next I'm going to work on my sidebar. I think I work on the sidebar. So I'm going to cover up this part because it's just so ugly. This is the one part about the Erin Condren <laughs> planners that I hate is that that thing on the top. So I'm going to place down um, some of my boxes and I'm also going to make my own sidebar. So in these mini kits, I make sure that you have plenty of functional boxes, check boxes and all that kind of stuff so that you can create your own sidebar using whatever you want to put over there. I've got lots of headers and stuff in there that I think will work really well. If you are looking for the full bells and whistles, got the sidebar, got all the deco, got all the, like I said, all the bells and whistles and you want to head back over to the shop and take a look at the weekly kits because the weekly kits have six pages of everything like you have. I think you have enough on those six pages to actually go through about two weeks worth. So on the mini kits though, it's meant more for just like the, the meat and potatoes of the kit, not necessarily all the fluff. So I do have 
a lot of deco boxes, but you don't obviously have to use them all. But then I've also got a lot of check boxes and functional boxes as well. So after I put down my whole row of my cute little deco, deco boxes, I'm going to use the washi. The washi is an add-on and so isn't the icon sheet. So if you like the washi and you want to use that instead of, um, you want washi that actually matches the kit, the artwork and the colors of the kit, you can add that on in the shop. Also the icons, which are colored to match the kits are also in the shop as an add-on. So for me, Mondays are my big days. That's when I try to get as much stuff done as possible. And they're also the days that hubby and I try to watch some. We get caught up on the UFC and or movies or shows or whatever. And also try to, um, since I'm a night shifter, once he goes to bed, I go in my office and I just start working on kits and um, get on the computer or um, on my silhouette, whatever it is that I'm working on. And I try to knock out as much as I can while he's sleeping. On Tuesdays, we have, um, this week we have a date night. Thursday through Sunday, this is a work week for me, so um, not a ton of stuff that's gonna go on on those days for me. Um, so I can really utilize a lot of the extra stuff, and then I can also use that time for a lot of planning. So like, um, I bring my little planner, I showed it in the unboxing, the little planner, um, carrier that goes inside my bag. I bring that with me to work and then on my downtime, when I have downtime, which isn't very often lately, um, I pull out that stuff and I just start trying to keep up with my planner and make sure that I fill out all the things that happened during the week so that I don't get too far behind. So that's pretty much all I can really put in on the work days other than putting down the, you know, the work stickers and then you know, some of the other things that happen at home um, every week that are the same, like trash days are on Thursdays, shopping days are, I'm not, not Thursdays, on Sundays, shopping days are on Sundays, that kind of stuff. So I've got the little cooking pot that came off of the icon sheet. I use that for my meal prep. And then there's all my workday stickers. And then just kind of filling in some of the stuff that as I already know ahead of time that this is what's going to be happening. Because this um, planning is being done early, a little bit early, but just so you know, uh, this all is live as of today. There's a sale going on, um, so it's 10% off of everything in the store. And if you spend over $35, you get free shipping until Wednesday, and Wednesday is the 26th. So I'm trying something out new on Etsy just to see um, how it works out. And no, I didn't adjust any of my prices, so everything is sale sale. Like. If you go back and look, I didn't, <laughs> like, one of the things that Etsy does is they, they kind of suggest that you alter some of the prices to make up for the shipping. I didn't do that, so everything is for real sale, so go have at it while, while it's there. It's kind of an experiment. I may or may not do it again, so if you're really looking for something and you want it, this is probably the best time to get it because I'm not sure I'll do it twice just kind of trying it out. So now I'm putting down some of my stickers from Paper Shire because I love Paper Shire stickers. Um, I have a whole list of, <laughs> I've got a whole like books and books and books of these guys. I love them. And that is going to do it. There's everything for this week and just got to fill in all the, all the rest of it, which is all of my, just my pen work. And that's pretty much going to do it. I hope you guys have a fabulous week. Go check out the shop, check out the sale, and I will see you again real, real soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.